All right, we're gonna open this up and see what happened with this. So uh, we'll take these off, and the most common problem. Sorry for the noise. Most common problem with these is the um, wrist pin bearing failure. So we'll see what's going on with this one. Okay, take the screws out, then we'll knock off that pan. Let's take the hammer. Yep. Okay, so if you look right here, always inspect this. This means that oil residue down in there is good. That means that, that they were using mixed gas. If this was cleaned off, that means it would be it would be using straight gas. So a little tip for you, pull that whole crankshaft assembly out. Yep, just like that. Might have to give her a whack. So we don't we don't need to worry about damaging anything because it's already damaged. Good, pull that thing out. And as you can see, this piston needs to swivel on that connecting rod. And what, what do you see? What do you notice? It's seized on there. Yeah. So that piston needs to move like this. Yeah. Um, okay, so that's the problem. So if you flip it over here, look at the inside of the piston. Upside down. Turn up and down. You can see how dry it is right there. Everything else is nice and oiled and lubed and everything. Yeah. And it's bone dry right there on that wrist pin. So lack of lubrication to the uh, wrist pin is the cause of failure.